Hi guys! It's me again, Angie, and nandito po tayo for another Kuyi Mini tutorial. So, as I promised before, I wanted to um, teach you my favorite tool here in Kuyi Mini. So, right now on my screen, meron po akong sticker that I use for packaging or closing my packaging here, like this one. But for example, I have an envelope and I use it as a lock for the envelope. So, this is a sample I have here. I can I'll copy it on another page so I can show you what I mean with the align tool. So to access the align tool, you have to right click, go to object and display tools, alignment, and then click this one, the last one, align and distribute. So I'll close this. I I'll click this. Uh, once you click that, this one, this toolbox will appear. Tapos, kapag meron ng toolbox dito sa gilid, all you have to do is to click the uh, item you want to arrange. So, this tool is helpful if you are doing logos like this and you want it to be straight, aligned, centered, and all of that. So, first of all, I have an A4 sheet here. You can adjust your sheet size dito sa uh, mat size right here. And A4 is in MM section. A4, ayan, click, and then we have their paper. Tapos, I'm just gonna click this apple, Contour Cut Wizard. Sorry this, if this is gonna be a bit fast. And kung taglish. Uh, you can see the marks here. What I usually do is just click page marks here on the lower side button. Click it, then ayan, may page marks kana. After that, I close the window. And then, since we have a ruler, um, a ruler tool here sa corners, Kapag lalabas na tong parang uh, up and down arrow, all I, have, all I do is, wait, I'll zoom in on the paper. Since this is the page marks, I want to make sure that di ako lalampas sa, uh, sa papel. And sa kung saan lang kaya nung cutter. So, ang ginagawa ko is, I just click the ruler, tapos merong lalabas na linya. At the center of the dot, just below the center, dun ko nilalagay. Kasi pwede rin naman hanggang center. I think that's maximum or uh, I think you can go further than center. But this is my safest um, advice. So for the left side, ganun din. Center pero offset lang konti pa loob para sure lang napasok yung ating um, ating cutter. Yung hindi siya biglang mag-stop or anything like that. So next is this doesn't need to be exact. It's just uh, reference or parang guide lang natin para hindi tayo lalampas. Okay? So, next is, I'll take my sticker design. Uh, Naka-group to siya. I ungroup. I'll ungroup. Okay. So, this is my design. And I want it to be cut in a circle. Um, if you don't know how to do a circle cutter, just go to the shape. And we have a circle here. Then, cut contour siya. But if you need another tutorial for that, I'll do a separate video. Right now, I'm just going to teach you how to use this Align Space uh, tool, Toolbox. Okay. So, first of all, if we click the two items, for example, gusto mo pareho silang, uh, isa-isahin ko yung tools na lang. Gusto mo silang naka-align sa left, click, just click, then naka-align sila on their most left part nila. Center nila sa isa't isa, ganyan. Cent uh, Paright, ganun din. Uh, kung gusto mo pareho silang Nasa top, for example, top na align click lang dito. Align top. Tapos kung gitna sa isa't isa, like this, then click lang din dito. Parang it's very understandable, eh, easily understandable because there's drawings, uh, illustrations dito sa gilid kung anong alignment yung sinusundan. So next is, gusto mo, gitna siya sa, pinaka gitna siya sa circle mo. So the thing you do is, we select all of it, then, align, and then another align here. Basta itong dalawa lang to. Because it's, it will align here, then it will align here. So, you, you have like a perfect center. So, that's what I do. Then, I group it just to make sure that uh, you can move it around together. So, next is, I want to make um, lots of copies for this one. So, what I do is to make sure, first of all, that it is grouped. Because if it's not grouped, and you do 
more uh, then it will separate obviously so basta naka group po yan siya tapos what we do we just copy paste ah yeah we just copy paste right here for example ganito uh s it's not even yung spacing nila we here in the align and space toolbox we have the space uh, tab so what you do is you select all make sure it's separately grouped okay uh, we have spacing here horizontal magka space ba dikit dikit ganyan or you can provide distance like that so sakto siya uh, I'll do 0.5 para pasok siya then as you can see aligned na siya perfectly evenly and um, uniformly tapos yun Next is, I'll go back to Align Space because what I want is to center it on the page. For That's where this Align as a Group comes in. So the thing is, you, since you have these are separate groups, all you have to do is select it all. So it, comes to, it moves together. Then I will select this one, Align as a Group, then Center. So it, what happens is it moves to the center of the page. Please don't mind my rulers kasi ano ko yan, uh, guide ko lang yan siya. If you remove this, this is really the center of the A4 page. So that's what I use. After that, you want to copy it evenly downwards. So what I do is I copy it all. Ah, no. First is I also group them as five. So you can have the option here below, group. So now they're all together. Now we just copy paste it. You can hold control so that it snaps like this, it snaps. Then usually I don't really need to evenly align this, pero mas madali na diba kung nakalign naman. So there, since I'll make it farther para example. So right now, it's a little messy, but you want, uh, I'll space it again horizontally, uh, vertically. So if you can see this, same na siya dun sa distance nila vertically. But I want to space it more, so I'll just add the inches here. Space apart by one inch. There you go. It's nicely spaced right now. And since it's not really center sa A4, again, I'll just select it all, then center here, this one. So, again, the difference of the difference of align objects to each other and align as a group is that, uh, oh, sorry, I'll just ungroup this. For this one, you align it to each of the objects. So, center, center. But for this one, for as a group, we align it on the page itself, so not on the object. So wherever you put it, you put it here, just click it, and then it will center to the page like this. So I hope that's, um, I hope that tutorial was easy to understand. If it's a bit fast, you can maybe repeat it, the video again, or maybe you can comment down below and tell me, or ask questions about this tutorial or um, complaints, reklamo. <laughs> but right now, that's my tutorial for the Align in, Space tip, uh, Align in Space toolbox. We have the distribute here, but I don't really use it. And I'm not sure how to use it yet. So right now, it's just Align in Space. Uh, for bonus display, if your items, I will ungroup this. Huh? I'll ungroup it all. Naka separate lahat. If you don't group them, this is what happens. Uh, you click here and everything will move. Click here. Ah, uh, no, not that. Click here, click here. Everything will move separately or like separate items. So if you click here, everything will move. So th we really don't want that. So as much as possible, group your um, objects. So that's my advice. So thank you so much. This is just a quick tutorial about the Align in Space tools. I hope you like this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to. 
I'll make more Kui mini tutorials in the future. Yeah, so thank you. Bye.